This is Al Zahra Arabian Horse Farm. It's the only horse breeding sector owned by the Egyptian Ministry of Agriculture and the biggest in the country. All horses must be registered here to be certified as pure breeds of Arabian horses. This 55 acres farm has been the focal point of Egypt's negotiations with the EU to lift its horses' ban. The ban's period has been extremely bad for the Egyptian markets. The supply was much more than the demand because no horses were allowed to leave Egypt. All auctions plummeted. Prices offered for the Egyptian horses, which are gigantic breeds, did not match their value. Back in 2010, when the EU imposed the ban, it said that some Egyptian horses carried diseases while the bloodline or family documentation of others were not accurate. Egypt has accepted the EU's demands and now samples of Egyptian horses will be analyzed in an international certified laboratory in Dubai for verifications. Despite the damage done to this estimated $430 million business, the country's deputy minister of agriculture says the new regulations were in Egypt's favor. The EU found many problems here. Among them was that we didn't have a fixed population of horses nationwide. Medical records also lacked certain procedures that would eliminate any room for manipulation. They were all measures to guarantee that when EU buys horses from us, they 100% match the records. Egypt now complies with EU standards for live horses importation. Auctions and horses sales are expected to once again boom. This government facility is already preparing for its biggest auction in a long time on September 19. Beautiful horses like these will be available for sale and exportation. This place has presented some of the best pure Arabian breeds to the world. We are the only place that managed to preserve the bloodline and the purity of Arabian horses. We do not introduce foreign blood to these trains. If you take a look at all the host champions in the world, you'll most probably find them a descent from our Egyptian families. Champion horses across the world are thoroughbred, and some of the characteristics required to give the horse the spirit, speed and agility it needs comes only from the purebred Arabian horses. This farm was established in 1928. It was built only to preserve and breed royal Egyptian horses. It now has 470 of these magnificent creatures bred from the same five families over the decades. During these past years, Egypt has worked really hard to make sure that its horses are disease-free. Now that the ban has been lifted, the country is rejoicing and feeling proud that its pure breeds will finally find another home across the world. Adel Mahroui, CGTN, Cairo.